Ooh, traitors. the whole story. So, this bright idea was the brainchild of you two? Hmm. How could you? Razor is Daddy's friend. And he was a good influence. Right up until you got him interested in wine. <sighs> Razor, you better promise me that you won't turn into one of those old booze hounds that drinks themselves silly slumps over the bar and bursts into tears. I, uh... I don't understand. Sounds like there's been some crossed wires here. Cree, what exactly did you say to Diona? Um, I told her that Razor is looking for his mommy with the honorary knight's help, and you both seemed really sad and said you needed some wine so maybe Diona could help. But before I finished, Diona said, Cree, say no more. I'm getting involved in this if it's the last thing I do. And then we came here. Uh... Uh, okay. Hyman doesn't even know where to start. Um, Diona, it sounds like Klee left out a few important details in the story. Let us set the record straight. So you're saying, Razor wants to make the same wine that his mother and father once made? So he can learn more about them? Hmm. You better not be making this up to try to pull the wool over my eyes. Sorry, Diona. It was all Clee's fault for not explaining it properly, so... Are you still mad? I caught a bunch of fish for us to eat. Um, and you can pack Dodoko too if you want. <laughs> I... I wasn't that angry. We we're just trying to help. I understand. I just don't want Razor being led astray, that's all. That's why I may have raised my voice a little bit just now. Mm. Well, since none of you plan on drinking it, then I suppose I can help you just this once despite my reservations. <laughs> <laughs> 